Now let's add some color to our scene, okay? Uh, right now I can see that it's a, uh, a default gray material. And if I want to add some color, maybe I'll start with the nose. And to do this, I'm going to right click on it and go to assign a new material. And this pops up, okay? Now I have to think about do I want it to be shiny? If I want it to be shiny, I'm going to choose blend. And if I don't, I'm going to choose Lambert. So I'm going to click on Lambert. And over here, I'm going to go all the way to the right. And there should be a tab called Lambert 2. It's called Lambert 2 because the default material is called Lambert 1. So I'm going to name this orange. And then I'm going to go to the color and I'm going to make that orange. So to make it orange, I'm going to select kind of my main color here and then the kind of the saturation of that color here, okay? Or I could move the sliders here if I find that kind of easier. Okay, good. Um, so that's orange. Now I'm going to make the eye black. So if I select the eye, right click, assign new material, Lambert, and I'm going to call this black. And then I want to make sure that I hit enter after, otherwise it might not stay what you have typed there. And now for the color, I'm going to click on this and I'm going to choose black. Now, if I want to assign that exact black to these other objects, I could shift select these objects. And now I could go right click, assign existing material, because I already have it in the scene. And you can see that there's my orange and there's my black. So I'm gonna choose black. There we go. And for his hat, I want that to be a black hat, but I want it to be shiny. So I'm going to select both of these, holding down shift and select them. Now I'm gonna right click, assign a new material blend and I'm going to go here and make it like this. I'm going to call this black underscore shiny. Okay. And I can see how the, sh the hat is kind of shiny now where the eyes and the buttons are not. Excellent. Now the last thing I might want to do is make the um, fence brown. The easiest way to select the fence um, is to do this. I'm going to drag select over everything like this and there it selected everything. Now maybe if I look at it from the top and hold down control and drag over the snowman and the ground while holding control it'll deselect that. Now I have only selected what I wanted. Okay so I'll show that once again. I'll drag select over everything and now I have to look at it from this angle from the top and I can hold down control and drag to unselect what I don't want. Now with the fence selected I can right click and instead of assigning a new material I could choose a favorite material. So this is going to give you the most common materials and you can see that Blinn and Lambert are right at the top of the list. Remember, Blinn is shiny, Lambert is not. I'm gonna to go to Lambert, and now I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna type in brown. And now if I go to color, um, I'm gonna choose brown. Excellent. Okay, great. Our snowman scene is really coming along. I think for the, um, maybe for the snow, I can select this and the ground assign favorite material, Lambert. And now maybe I name this snow. And I go in here and make it maybe a slightly off white. All right, looking good.